Welcome to Vlogmas Day 5. We've got a box from Innova, and I don't remember what I ordered, so I figured I'd do an unboxing video for you guys. I only remember one of the discs, so I'm actually gonna be a little bit surprised as well. I think I have an idea, but I, I know I always order crazy stuff, so let's go ahead and see what we got. So this is a small box right away, so I'm hoping that uh, it's just stacked to the top with discs, because I remember I ordered quite a lot. All right, first disc, we have a Pro Pig. I guess this is the stiff variety, because I know they have a soft and a stiff variety. I mean, honestly, it feels really nice. And it's got that uh, factory store stamp. It's pretty cool, 172 grams. It looks like it'd be glow, and I doubt it is. I'm gonna take it into the other room. Okay, I'm back. It's definitely not glow. It just looks like glow plastic. It's like that off-white. But anyways, next disc, uh, same pig, <laughs> got the exact same one. These just feel real, I like almost want to bag it myself. It's actually a really nice disc. Next disc, same thing, got got the pro, the pro pig. I, I didn't realize I ordered so many of these, but the, these look really nice and they're all the same weight, pretty cool. It feels like a really nice disc. I've thrown pigs before, they're so overstable. It's definitely a good approach disc, but uh, Next disc, we have, so I thought this was gonna look a little bit different, but we have a DX Stamp Champion Gazelle, right? I think that's what this is. So this is like that Jolly Rancher plastic. I'm surprised it has the flight numbers though. I thought it didn't. So I'm a little bit upset by that, but um, you know, it's Pop Top Champion Gazelle. And usually, if it's a Jolly Rancher, that's what they call it, Jolly Rancher stamp, if it's like the DX stamp on the Champion plastic, then usually they're collectible, so I decided to pick one up. And uh, I guess I decided to pick two up, because we have, oh, this one's a little bit different though. Ooh, it's got like metal flakes in it. I don't know if you guys can see that. Like really closely, there's some like flakes in it, and it's got, and it's much darker red. Like this is this one's way cooler. This one is way cooler than that other one. This one I might have to keep. But unfortunately, it's 157 grams, so it's not going to be the best for throwing in the wind. But the next disc, you've seen it before, and uh, it's a very hard disc to come by. So I, I I understand why I bought it again. It's another Wahoo, a Blizzard Wahoo. This one has like a silver stamp. And on the back it says 175 grams. Uh, very stiff. I, I don't know how stable this thing is, but I don't know, I've never been a fan of the 12-speed rim. This, this thing has six glide, it says. I'm sure it goes a mile. Comment down below if you've ever thrown one of these. Next disc, I guess I got a second one. Another Blizzard Wahoo, same weight. And uh, you can tell they've been sitting around the warehouse for a very long time. They've never been thrown, obviously, but like in the middle there, you can't even like make out what weight it is unless you get really close up and you can actually see like where they, what it like is scratched in. <laughs> but usually there's like a pen there. And I don't know, these have been sitting around the warehouse for a very long time. And this one, this one's kind of nasty. It's like slick underneath, or at least this one spot. Uh, maybe it's just some oil or something. I don't know what the heck would be, why there'd be oil on the disc, but it felt like really slippery underneath. Anyways, got two Wahoos. Next disc, I gotta stop looking into the box before, so I'll put it way over here. Next disc is a Pro Pig again, and on the stamp it says soft. So this is the soft Pro Pig. And um, let me just try to compare these two. Let's see if there's a difference that I can feel. So the normal Pro Pig is like not concave at all. It's like completely flat. And I guess it is like a little bit less flexible. And then this Soft Pig is a little bit flexible. You can feel it's like uh, more grippy. It's not really like softer, but it, this one is concave. These ones are completely flat. This one is concave. And I think I got this one because I love this red color. I love the color red. It, I'm, it's definitely my favorite. And I swear I throw red discs just farther. I don't know, comment down below. Do you guys throw a certain color farther? Maybe it's something in the brain. But I swear every time I have a red driver, it just goes forever. 
But um, this is a this is a pretty nice one, and it's concave. It feels a little bit uh, more comfortable, and definitely more grip. You can hear that. Next disc, the last disc actually. Dang, I thought there'd be more. The last disc is another Pro Pig, and this is soft again. This one is not as concave as that red one. A little bit concave. It's definitely not flat. It's like slightly concave. And this one is feels a little bit different than this red one. This red one is like super grippy. This one's more grippy than those white ones, but a little bit concave. Oh, this one's a bit more flexible though, but look at that. Like I can actually do that. So this one is probably the most flexible out of all the pigs that I have. And uh, yeah, it's got that soft stamp thing right down there. But uh, decent haul, I guess. I'm probably gonna be trading off or selling a lot of these. And listen to that, they like, are like glued to each other almost because of this soft, grippy plastic. These pro ones kind of just slide around, but these soft ones are like glued together. It's kind of weird. But anyways, guys, let me know in the comments what disc I got today that's your favorite. And leave a like if you enjoyed, if you're enjoying this Vlogmas so far. And I'll see you tomorrow for Vlogmas Day 6.